You're not a monarchist. Monarchies are also states. States are rip-off organizations everywhere. But if you look at the current situation, it was interesting to see that, of course, the monarchies that were under attack handled the attacks far more successfully than those states that were dictatorial, that is considered to themselves to be public administrations, Republican administrations. The situation in Morocco and Jordania is significantly better than the situation was in Libya. In Egypt, for instance, which indicates precisely what I said. Relatively speaking, dictatorships are typically the outgrowth of democracy. Democracy running into difficulties. And then the outcome of the difficulties that democracies run into is the erection of dictatorships. Dictatorships are a republican phenomenon, not a monarchical phenomenon. Hitler was certainly more democratic, so to speak, than the German Kaiser. Stalin was certainly more democratic than the Russian Tsar. The Russian Tsar was not a very nice person, but as compared to what came afterwards, he was just a marvelously nice person. Kaiser Wilhelm II was not the greatest person on earth, but as compared with Hitler, of course, he was a nice man. We have to compare things in a balanced way. The current situation seems to indicate that monarchies are by and large a better system than democracies turned into dictatorships. Dictatorships are a republican phenomenon, not a monarchical phenomenon. So, 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 so.